So it's pretty crazy out there and there's a lot of unpleasantness in the news both locally and for some folks at home. My goal with this series is to serve as somewhat of a distraction from some of that. For you and I had to have a little fun together and maybe for a moment, escape. Before we get started, I'd like to give a shout out to my Aunt Marlis and my mom and dad. And I hope things get better for everyone real soon. Okay, so for this week, we're gonna go back to 1981. Some of you may be really familiar with the number one hit off of this album, but the song I'm gonna play for you today is my personal favorite. Now, obviously it's just me here, and in order to do this song justice, there really needs to be four. So I'm, while well, I am gonna be playing all the instruments, when it comes to the drums, you're not gonna see that because I'm using a keyboard and I'm using this software here, Abbey Rhodes drums, and you just don't wanna see me playing the keyboard because it just kinda of looks something like this, just kinda of looks something like this. Just kinda of looks something like this. And you know, <laughs> I'm no Ross Peterson, so I have to use a keyboard in order to be able to play the drums. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, I hear you. Shut up and play your guitar. Here we go, from 1981, the album Working Class Dog, Rick Springfield, my cover of Love Is All Right, Tonight. 